Closer to home, several Spalding County bus drivers are off the job right now battling COVID-19. Griffin Spalding County School leaders tell us nine bus drivers have tested positive for the deadly virus. And as Newshead reporter Brian Hill explains, other drivers are really concerned tonight after two co-workers died from the virus. One Spalding County school bus driver tells me she's thinking about retiring because of these positive COVID-19 cases. She tells me a lot of her co-workers are worried right now after two of their colleagues died. I am so afraid of getting this again. Griffin Spalding County school bus driver Cathedral Jones tells me she's jittery and anxious on the job after going through her own difficult battle with COVID-19 last year. Her concerns have now worsened after she says two of her co-workers just died from the virus. I still have lung damage, permanent lung damage. My breathing is very short sometimes. School district officials confirmed that a bus driver and her bus monitor passed away last week. They tell us that nine other bus drivers were out Monday due to positive COVID-19 cases. Two are currently hospitalized and one is on a ventilator. I stayed in ICU myself for three months. So to know that someone else is going through that is, is just devastating. Here's what Jones believes the district can do right now to ease their concerns. Shut all the way down, let everybody quarantine probably for the two weeks to just see where we are. Because I think if going in and coming out and still mixing and mangling, that's not solving any problems. The shortage of drivers due to COVID and other reasons has impacted school bus routes. The district tells us they're currently combining bus routes where possible and many drivers run multiple routes to help get the children to and from school. That plan is a concern for Jones, who says combining the routes could negatively affect contact tracing. Uh, when you go back and pick up other routes, you may have 30 or 40 children at a time and they may not have masks on. They may not be social distancing. You, you don't have a chance to spray and sanitize your bus before you pick up other children. District leaders say they're actively recruiting and training new drivers to replace those sick bus drivers. The district has offered health benefits, retirement and a $500 signing bonus. According to the most recent health data from the school district, 180 students and 29 employees currently have the virus. The district requires masks, quarantine students when needed and sanitizes buses and school spaces. In Spalding County, Brian Hill, Fox 5 News.